Hi everyone, this is Kamel. Welcome back to Video Proc official channel. In this series of tutorials, we are going to show you how to make more creative videos by color grading with a color editor in Video Proc Flagger. Before we dive into the journey, make sure you check out the link in the description box below to download the software for free. All right, now let's get the video started. The photography is similar to how our eyes work. Our eyes lens work together with a cornea to focus the light on the retina. The retina transforms the light to electrical signals. The brain can receive the signals and turn them into images. So, by adjusting the chiaroscuro and color changes in the video, we can create various fun effects. In today's video, we are going to teach you how to analyze the lighting and the color of your footage for turning the day shot to cloudy day or night by using the color editor in Video Proc Flagger. Let's firstly import this footage, drag it onto the video track. Click on the color button on the toolbar to enter the color editor. You can also click on the color in the filter editor button on the inspector panel to get there. In the new color editor panel, we can find the preset 3D lots on the left. The preview window on the middle. The panel on the right is for customizing the color properties. Herein, we can adjust the color lot intensity, sharpen, edge SL, and vignetting. A small notice, the lot intensity is for adjusting the intensity of the applied lot. Before color grading day for night, let's spend a little time analyzing the footage. This footage was shot at day, the major source of light comes from the reflection of sunlight on the river and the leaves. This is why most of the bright parts are found in these areas. And green is the dominant color of this video. But when shooting in the darkness, less light can enter the lens and our eyes. So we need to decrease exposure. At night, the reflection on the moonlight on the river is more noticeable, thus we need to bring up the contrast. The light in the cloudy days is diffuse, so the color should be less saturated. Let's decrease the saturation to simulate the brightness of the cloudy day. Here, I increase the shadows a little bit and decrease the whites and blacks. This ensures I can keep as many details as possible when I get a video darker. Now let's take a close look at the color. We just found that green is the dominant color in this video, but in cloudy days and night, the forest appears in blue because it reflects blue most strongly. So we need to transform the dominant color from green to blue. In the HSL menu, we can adjust the hue, saturation, and the luminous properties for the seven colors to adjust the overall tone for the footage. By dragging the saturation slider of the HSL, you'll get a rough idea of the video's color distributions. In this video, stones get a red tint Yellow and green are reflected from the plants. Blue, cyan, and magenta are from the river mostly. Now let's adjust the hue. Drag the hue sliders for all these colors towards blue. Bring up the saturation for the colors of the plants and the water. Here are the specific adjustment parameters. Now the video looks like it was a shot at night. Let's add some tweaks to perfect the details. We can boost the amount value for sharpen to simulate the noise in the night shot. Last, adjust the vignetting to darken the surrounding light. This can fake a focused light source in the center. 
Okay, we just finished the color grading. We can click on Show Source screen to check the video before and after the grading. Click on Apply. That's it. All right, now you reach the end of today's video about how to turn day into night in a video in Video Prac Flagger. I think I've got it. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you in our next tips. Hope and enjoy. Bye.